Next time Indiana lawmakers craft a budget, the person behind it will be different. Senate Republicans are looking for a new appropriations chair after the current announced he's retiring. Yeah, this is a big decision mm -hmm. that lawmakers say will have a major impact on future budgets. Indiana State House Bureau Chief Nick Notario joins us now to explain. No doubt this has ripples at the State House. Some major ripples. You know, this was huge news that yes. it broke yesterday. Mm -hmm. Today we finally got to catch up with him. But you know, he's not only crafted major legislation, this is the man who's been behind the budget for a number of years. After passing the current budget that started less than a week ago, he told us today he felt the timing was right, although even Democrats are sad to see him go. Senator Lou Kenley is leaving in September. He's not done yet, though. He spent the day in a state budget committee hearing to get an explanation on why the state is taking over the I-69 project near Bloomington. During the meeting, his colleagues congratulated him. They know filling his role won't be easy. He plays a major role in crafting that budget. But Senator Kenley says now is the perfect time to step aside. I started out as a person who really was never that enthused about government. And somehow I managed to serve two and a half years in the Army and 15 years as a city court judge and then 25 years as a state senator. If they were having a problem with something in Gary, he would get in his car and drive up there and say, explain this to me now. Um, and, you know, and, and that's what it took to do that job, and he has done it. Senator Kenley says passing the road funding bill was another reason why he felt he needed to retire now. The law increases the price of the pump and adds fees, which started Saturday. But he believes this plan will maintain Indiana's roads for years to come. He's out of Hamilton County. Party leaders will make a decision this fall on his replacement. Senate Republican leaders have some more time, though, to select a new chair. Next session doesn't start for another six months. Dignitarium, 24-hour news 8.